It feels like, you know, with the Kobe Bryant death and his age, and he had started his second career, and, you know, he was great at what he was doing, and had the, you're about the same age, you and Kobe. Yeah, yeah, he was 41, I'm 41. Yeah. Yeah. And then I don't know how that hits you at, you know, it hit me, you know, I'm a lot older, but it's just the children part of it, you know, you, that your daughter and. Yeah, listen, um, his daughter being with him, I mean, for, for a parent, you, you just, you, you ache and, and you hurt so badly for uh, his wife and, and, his, and his kids. And I, I, think, I think what also hit me too with, with his passing was, you know, here was a guy who truly transcended basketball. You know, so many, so many guys in our league, if you think about it, are between the age of 22 and 25 years old, right? You know, these guys grew up That's their idolizing Kobe Bryant, right? Yeah. These guys are now professional football players, but you can honestly say that Kobe probably had a tremendous influence on them, right? Um, and so regardless of what sports you play, like you recognize his greatness, not just as a player, but as a leader and just how driven he was. Um, and then as he tra was transitioning into kind of this second career, as you know, you know coaching his daughter you know w watching her develop the same love and passion for the game that has had done so much for him and obviously what he was doing with his career and everything he was involved with i mean there was so much to be admired and so i think kobe lives within so many of us because not only were we fans but we were inspired by a lot of the things that he did and i think that's the great thing about sports and, and having that second career, you know, that he did where he wanted to be as successful as he was as a basketball player. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV, stream for free on BR Live, or download the Dan Patrick Show app.